Just wanted to show you a cool feature that I've just discovered in a new version of the Mu Python editor, um, as well as being able to just write Python code that you can flash directly onto your micro bit. Um, it's got a new feature here that goes alongside the REPL. You've got a plotter. I understand this may have been uh, come from an idea from Lady Ada from Adafruit. And let's have a look what happens. Here's a very simple bit of Python code. All it will do is take readings from the accelerometer and print them, uh, print them to the REPL. So if we open up the REPL and we'll flash that code to the micro bit, so it flashes straight onto the micro bit. I love the fact that with Mu you don't have to drag and drop hex files, it just sends it to the micro bit. We should get some values start appearing on the screen. So we've got readings from the accelerometer in the three different axes. You can kind of interpret them, but wouldn't it be fantastic if you could actually see them? And that's where the plotter comes in. If you click on the plotter button, you can now see a visual representation of each axis. So my micro bit is currently lying flat on the table. See what happens if I just flip it on its back. So I'll turn it over. Oh, look, we can see lots of disturbance there. And you see now the orange line has now gone way up to the top. So you can see now which which of those three figures is actually recording which way up it is in terms of whether it's on its front or its back. If I turn it on its side, and I'll see which figure is uppermost now. You can see the blue line has dropped right down. If I turn it on its other side, that blue line shoots up to the top. If I shake it about, it's kind of like earthquake mode. You can see which I'm shaking it from side to side. You can see it's moving in one particular way. If I shake it up and down, you should see something slightly different happen. So there we go. So it's a really, really neat way of being able to visualize um, data coming off from the micro bit. Also, we can do that so quickly. That is just four lines of Python code. And you've got a little experiment that kids could do. They could just plug it in, type four lines of code, and they can actually see stuff happening in real time. It's absolutely amazing. Um, you could do that so easily in a lesson. Um, I'm full of ideas now about where, where else you could take that, what else you could do with it. But it's absolutely amazing. I love the fact it's so interactive and it just happens straight away. It's brilliant.